Oh, he said connecting me. He must be friends with me. That's a friendship connection. Oh yeah, this one where you just have to stand in there for time. Oh my god. Someone's like spitting goo at me. You nasty yourself, you vomiting on me? Bro, look in the mirror, you vomit at yourself on me. Alright, we got it, we got it. Alright, good job, teammates. Jeremy's defection, the plan is to capture him alive and carry out a detailed interrogation. However, after analyzing the characteristics of the Volgus DNA and the Kuiper, I think we need to understand Jeremy's motives first, so that we can be two steps ahead of him. First off, from the Volgus DNA collected here, we identified malignant cells, those which have been exposed to void energy. Well, we'd call them malignant cells, but for the Volgus, they're more of a genetic enhancement. They give them higher bone density and muscle growth. And we've detected high levels of void energy in the Volgus Kuiper you discovered. For humans, this affected Kuiper is highly contaminated material which cannot be processed and used for any products. But for the Volgus, it is enhanced Kuiper. Can you see the connection? Both the cells and the Kuiper have been altered as the result of exposure to the void, and both are needed to create enhanced Volgus. I'm not sure why Jeremy needs them, but I do know where we can find them. The Abandoned Zone. Throughout Ingress' history, it's been identified as the first area to be connected to the Void Dimension, and the worst source of contamination is located in Echo Swamp. That's where we need to go. We can either overtake Jeremy, or at least find traces of him. Huh? Hold on. That's the emergency comm signal. Is anybody there? This is Asimo. We can't move. We're surrounded by enemy forces. Asimo, what's your location? I'm at the abandoned area. I was sent here on a mission to destroy the Volgus facility. to go on. Right now, the only thing we can be sure of is that they're nearby. Actually, this works in our favor. This is our chance to rescue Asimo and track down Jeremy. I'll search for traces of Jeremy and the Ironheart with a guide. Please rescue Asimo and take him to the forward base. I am definitely detecting a very minute presence of RK in this zone. I appear to be unable to transfer my consciousness into it. This narrows it down to two possibilities. Either this is Jeremy's RK, or the RK of Esimo, who is unconscious. We can't miss this opportunity. Is 
Defendant, this is number 17. SMO may be being held inside this facility. I'm going in. I won't be long. Hold the attention of the forces for me. Nice, I got a teammate. Right? He's helping me, right? Even though it's not part of the mission. What? Okay. Yeah, weird Texas name. Bro, I swear that guy's possessed or something. Down here, ooh, we're going to creepy town. Oh, this is a very narrow tunnel, bro. It's going to be a line of bullets. That's how it's going to look like. This guy has a crazy shield, he got spikes on it too. Oh, I got him. Alright, I got a spider man to do damage to him. I go bind him. Nice. Oh, they're all grouped up, perfect. I put a disco ball for you guys to dance. That's spider minute. Did the guy die? Where did he go? Bro, help me, please. No! <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> Why is there a random clip there? Oh, good job, Tinix. Alright, let's get some bullets, man. We got no bullets right now. No, no bullets that I needed, then.
Wait, what? I don't see you. Oh, I see. My bad, my bad. I thought there would be another platform. I was just waiting for it to come. Ah, I see, but that's in the line for me perfectly. Nice, we did it. Okay. Damn, ninety five percent. Mad, bro, is this for real? Bro, this is chaos. What is going on? I actually don't know what's going on. I just, bro, this is like, but the world's ending. The world's actually ending. <laughs> I can't. What is this? <laughs> Let me hit target or something. I'll throw my buzzer for you. Bro, there's no cover. What am I supposed to do? I can't even see where the enemy is. This is like so much stuff. So much stuff in my vision. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Alright, we fight. Bro, this is this is a cataclysm, man. Look at all these asteroids, man, coming from the sky. Calling them Boker. Haha. <laughs> that guy is thank you. Oh, this is gun still has zero but air up. The barrier was like red earlier, and now it's cool. It's like clear. The red barrier was scary. I don't know why I looked like that. Hey, 200 bullets. Let's go. Small explosive expert who feels condemned for blowing everything up. <laughs> yeah, that, it did say he has opposite personality from Enzo. The descendant was Miss Maestro destination, utterly explosive fanatic. In contrast to his graphic experience, he possesses a kind heart and treasures his family. As you know, my mission was to remove the source of the contamination in the abandoned area before it spread to Albion. Where you rescued me, near the pipe there, my unit and I were looking for the source of the contamination connected to that pipe. We were on the verge of finding it. But the soldiers in my unit started getting sick, one by one, from some unknown disease, while the order of truth seemed to be getting stronger by the day. You know I have a sensitive nose, right? Well, my soldiers and the enemy smelled the same to me, but their symptoms, how the disease affected them, were the opposite of each other. It doesn't make any sense. Once I figured that out, I didn't just sit on my butt. I mobilized all of my men who were able to move and scoured the nearby area. That's when they turned on me. I knew I shouldn't have pushed them so hard. What? 
Jeremy showed up, and you know what that idiot said? Albion considers all of you to be expendable. Follow me, and I'll give you power. Let's take down Albion together. Uh, it sounded like a bunch of hogwash, but then he took out the Iron Heart, and it was the first time any of us had seen something that had seemed like just a rumor. To be honest, it was also the first time I'd seen the real thing in person, and even I thought it was pretty extraordinary. Though because I'd been connected to the guy from the start, I didn't fall for Jeremy's speech. But when that bastard said what he needed for his plan was nearby, one by one, my men pointed their guns at me. What did Jeremy say it was again? What he needed? That's right, a seed storage. And I knew the source of the contamination was there too. My nose told me. You're planning on going to the seed storage now, aren't you? In that case, focus on finding Jeremy. Destroying the source of the contamination, the seed storage, was my original mission. I'll try and recover, and get back on track with that as soon as possible. I'll make sure to blow up whatever it is that Jeremy is trying to get his hands on. Seed vaults. All the all of environmental pollution in the Venom Zone probably originated at this ominous facility. The identified kind of invitation just earned the moniker, the monkey, or oh, moniker, swamp sickness among soldiers causing disease in humans while simultaneously giving the Volgus power. Put simply, the facility serves as a strategic Volgus facility while also polluting the environment. Mmm, polluting the environment. Swinging on that, like we don't need to do it. Oh, actually, I swap guns. This is a ray gun. Damn. Yeah, they are super tanky. I just realized that they are like extremely tanky. Wait, what? Oh, what's my bad, my bad. <laughs> You're just standing still, bro. He's just watching the fight, bro. Help your How does he kill me that fast? <laughs> he too shot me, man. We just spawn camping, then we put a black hole over the spawn. <laughs> they better not spawn when they see that. It's their fault, they chose to spawn. Just the idea of how 
I'm just electrocuting them and it explodes when they die. That's crazy. Oh, but this gun can overcharge. Closed on me. <laughs> me in. Oh, those are the polluted zombies. They got the disease. They're like green. They're like nuclear zombies. Ooh! That a boss? Yeah, it is. Okay, that makes sense. I'm like, no way a regular guy just did that. Holy guacamole! Freeze right there! <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> There's so much damage. Is that on the ground? Oh no. I'm good. Oh, oops. I swear he disappeared. Am I tripping? Yeah. 
Guys, reaction time is so slow. <laughs> Come on, guys. You should be ashamed of being my teammate. I mean, no. Wait. Other way around. Guys, stop standing in there. <laughs> I swear they're gonna die, and I'm gonna have to revive them right beside the boss. That won't be good. I mean, he's like, he's standing beside the boss, and he's fine. So never mind. Let me just right past me. <laughs> he disappeared. Woo! There's so much people. They're all connected in a giant spider web. Web of life. Okay, we leaving. Oh my god, they do so much damage. Oh, I can't die, I can't die, I can't die. Come on, come on. I did it. We voted everything. <laughs> oh, someone beside. Oh my god. Alright, where's the bullets coming from? Oh, he's behind me. Oh my god. Keep on. Keep on getting back. Keep on getting back. Bro, how my team is just staying beside him and surviving and I'm, I'm far away and I'm dying? That, that makes no sense. Alright, good. We can shoot him again. Oh, he's staying beside me, bro. You're just ignoring me. <laughs> no, no! I went into it! Alright, good. I've, I've ordered this stuff. There's someone behind me, right? Oh my god. There's a lot of people behind me. Bro, someone's still shooting me. How? How? Alright, good. We're fine. fine. Good job, guys. <laughs> Wait, what is this thing? I want to see it. Oh, Tree of Truth. Location, there will be no suitable zone for Jeremy to obtain high density Kuiper from. Should he look for Kuiper in an outside source, he will not be able to avoid being detected by us. Nice, good job. 